Is it? Okay. The government is keen on introducing Maisha number. It's keen on introducing Maisha card. It's also introducing Maisha digital ID. And it's also introducing Maisha integrated database. Four items in one. And this morning, we had uh, a public participation forum with religious leaders from across different faiths. Ranging from NCCK, we had... Uh, Soup came, we had Hindu council, we had Catholic uh, bishops, we had all of them invited this morning for a public participation forum. And I'm happy to report that we have a good engagement with them. We have had many questions which uh, our team have been able to answer. And I'm happy to inform the country that the religious leaders have agreed to support the rollout of Maisha number. This is in addition to other meetings, other public participation meetings, and I'm, report, I'm happy to report to the country that we have had 698 public participation forums across the country, supported by our national government administration officers. We have had forums in all the 378 sub-counties across the country. And this is in a bit to have more buy-ins, this is in a bit to engage more, to sensitize the public more, because issues to do with identity are cross-cutting and they involve many stakeholders. They involve many partners across the board. And uh, I'm happy to report that we have had engagements with the civil society, the private sector, the media, development partners, the business community, Ngao, and many other persons who are engaged in the digital identity ecosystem. So today's meeting, I want to say, was able to create more understanding, to broaden the scope, to be able to explain more details about what we are doing to ensure that we roll out this Maisha number. And I'm happy to inform the country that public participation continues. We continue engaging the public. We, we, we continue engaging different uh, groups of persons. Like next week Tuesday, we have planned a forum with civil society so that we can also be able to explain to them more and more about this very important uh, project. I want to say that we call upon all the interested groups to still continue submitting the memoranda of some of the issues they feel need to be taken care of in, uh, in the rollout of this very important project. The government is keen to listen to every concern, every idea, whether small or big, to ensure that we we'll get it right this time around. As you may be aware, there have been quite a number of attempts towards ensuring that we have a, a digital ID. But the, 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 the attempts have failed because of lack of uh, inclusivity, lack of uh, more public participation, but we are keen to get it right this time around. I'm also happy to inform the country that we are able to do what we call data impact assessment, and we are able to submit to the data commission the data data impact assessment report, which is part and parcel of this uh, of this very important uh, process. I'm also happy to inform the country that uh, the cabinet secretary for Minister of Interior, Professor Kendiki has gazetted amendments to the regulations to be able to give us a way out towards uh, implementation of this very important project. So I'm happy to inform the nation that we have new regulations that are going to govern the rollout of the Maisha number, Maisha card, Maisha digital, and Maisha integrated database.